Hello and welcome back. Uh, in this video, we will be learning how to make an AI diagram using Workbench. The prerequisites that are required are just the working of the Workbench. And second prerequisite is uh, needed to have uh, uh, tables in the, um, whatever project you are having, that tables should be present in the database. So already I have tables in uh, my database and I will be continuing with uh, it and I will be showing you how to show the uh, ER diagram using them. So you need to open this uh, MySQL workbench and you need to go to this uh, ER diagram section. And after clicking on this, you need to click on models. After clicking on this model, you need to go to databases then click on reverse engineer. You need to enter the host name, your username, and here local connection. Uh, for here, you can use uh, Amazon uh, MySQL as well. That's why they, they have uh, provided this uh, stored connections. Then click on the next. Uh, MySQL Workbench has connected successfully to DBMS. It has uh, retrieved the schemas, schemas, what are the schemas uh, present on the database. And then click on next. Here, this is a very important section. You need to select which uh, uh, database you want to uh, use for uh, creating the ER diagram. So I will be using uh, hospital management database. This is my project database. This is my SEDEC uh, project database. Here, all the objects are retrieved successfully. I will be clicking on execute. It will be executing the query to create an AI diagram. And here the final our AI diagram ready. After that, you can just uh, arrange it according to your need. I'll be arranging. I'll show you how to arrange. Uh, you need to arrange according to hierarchies, the number of connections and the data tables. This is my medicine assigned. Uh, I am uh, arranging this thing, uh, this uh, tables according to hierarchy. User will be the highest. User will be having employees. And users will be having patients. Moreover, employees will be having, um, means a doctor is an employee, employee is an user. Patient is a user. And here, the table which links, you need to push it upward. This is the data table. This is a very useful tool. You can directly create a diagram and uh, you can save it as per your requirement as uh, if you require a PDF or uh, if you require a JPEG, JPEG image, you can do so. Just by uh, dragging, you can adjust the placement and all. From this, you can uh, have multiple options. Here you can copy the column names to the clipboard. In the next videos, I will be showing you how to uh, take the backup of the data, MySQL data, and uh, how to retrieve that uh, data back into your database. Thank you very much.